Welcome back to world building. This is my humble abode. I lied. Here it is. Would you just look at that? Oh, it's very beautiful. This bit looks a bit weird. That does that. Oh, it's pretty. Looks like a, a drug den. Cow pit. Good. That's the base. You know when you get into a Minecraft world and you see these holes everywhere and, and you don't like it? Well, I can help. That was... It's like an advert. This whole island has been demolished and I've started building it up myself. And in a few videos I'm gonna do, I'm gonna show you how you can do some cool custom terrain and then do some cool buildings. We're gonna do a little, and in this video I'm gonna show you how you can do one of the big custom terrain projects I'm doing. A big part of this build is I wanted to go underground as well. So the idea is a giant hole in the surface. There's gonna be a whole layer underneath the island, almost like a basement. A lot of this is very self-explanatory through the images and it's kind of a learning curve of what looks good and what doesn't. But starting off, you want to dig a little shape like this and then completely roughen up the edges and then do exactly the same in the layer beneath. Get rid of that, place that with some grass and then do exactly the same again. At this point you just want to dig down a few layers. You want to make sure that there's three blocks of dirt and then you can transition into the stone and do that on all sides. Then, okay, following, good. Then from beneath dirt, get rid of the stone and then dig down a few more layers. So I've marked out a random pattern in the stone and then you're gonna wanna just get rid of it. From this point, you can stop and we can go kind of one of two ways an underwater thing and a, a, a gra grass thing. First of all, let's do the underwater thing. So just fill it with water, you can figure out how to do that. Pick a block and replace the stone on the ground with it. Then, dig out some little pits like this. And then realise you're an idiot, change the resource pack, change the block on the floor, and then carry on like nothing happened. Just put some seagrass around, put some kelp, let that grow. And then, we can start to add some more detail. Like this rock, make it mossy. Hello fish, make it grassy as well. And then do it again a few times. And there you go. Yay. Now the fieldy thing. Replace that ground with dirt. Let it grow. We're going to have a higher layer here and we're going to have a lower layer there. And then detail it a little bit. I've used podzle and coarse dirt in little patches like this. Then bone meal it. Then put some leaves around. Kind of like this. Or this. Or this one there. Or that one. You know, just bushes. I'm going to do a rock in three simple layers. One on the ground, one there, and one there. Make it mossy, it's fine. And then another one there, make it mossy. And there you go. But now, we're going to get into the big one. So, we're going to be digging down, and every time we dig down, we're going to knock out a few more, like this. And then down again, knock out a few more, down again, knock out a few more. And you just do that, okay, yeah, another time, there we go. And cool. And then dig right down. So you've now got it curved, going into a bigger pit. Then all you have to do is go around the edge and dig out the blocks as far as you can reach in a giant circle. Okay, so then you just need to get rid of the bottom layer and then three more layers above that. And put torches everywhere because there's bloody bats. Why are they in the game? I don't get it. This bit along here, you need to smooth that out so it reaches the edges of the area you just dug out. And this is what I did. It should look a little bit like this. You can copy it. But this is like a trial and error thing. You just kind of keep moulding the walls until it looks smooth and like a cave. It looks a bit flat. It looks a bit plain. So what you then do is go around and add some patches of andesite. Okay, cool. Now, uh, dirt floor. Okay, now the grass has grown. We're going to detail the ground. So I've gone down one layer there, down one layer there, and then up one layer there. They can just be random shapes. And then the easiest thing to detail the ground, bone meal everywhere, get rid of the flowers. Because I don't know when to stop, I'm using these flowers, then just throw them around in patches. Then I've gone and added some coarse dirt patches. Then bushes, just stick some leaves on the patches of coarse dirt. And that's that, it's done. But I'm just gonna say one thing. If you want to enjoy building more, I do recommend finding a building resource pack. This is it in default, this is it in the B-dubs pack, and this is it in the Jersey Boy building pack. They make a big difference. The B-dubs pack is not free, it's through Patreon, but the Jersey Boy pack is going to be linked down below in the description because that is completely free. Now I stuck some random roots in the ceiling, 
because again I don't know when to stop but you don't have to do that. Isn't it great? I love it. It's not easy uh, but it's a lot of practice. The more you do it uh, the more natural it feels and you can just kind of sculpt things and just go ham. It's a lot easier and creative but get yourself a beacon, get yourself an efficiency 5 pick with haste 2 on the beacon and go ham. That's how I did it. And then you can put whatever you want in here. As long as there's not goddamn bats. You... Anyway, so that's it. That is it for the tutorial. Let's go and see what it's like in my world. Stuff's happened. I've lost everything. That's a thing. It's been a while. Been about two months since I've actually recorded here. I'm going to show you what my thing that we just built looks like in my world. Is... Whoa, okay. This is it. It's a bit bigger than the one that we just built. I have wings on, I think. I do. It's looking good. It's looking real good. Eventually, we're going to get some stuff built down here, maybe some shops. The idea is that it's a trading island. I might have mentioned that, I don't know. I recorded two months ago. I did exactly as I said in the tutorial, except this is kind of scaled up a little bit. I put some cool support beams, not be but be beam, beams, it's made of stone. It's a support thing, it's like a pillar. What is it called? I don't know. Anyway, um, yes, it's done. Eventually, uh, it's not done actually, it's, it's not done, <laughs> I just noticed, it's not done. Uh, I've not put the coarse dirt patches and the leaves and all the bushes and stuff in, uh, but I'm going to do that as I go and fill it with buildings. I made a cool little thing over here though, it made me realise that the way water works in Minecraft is a massive nightmare. Anyway, <laughs> that was slick. Okay, um, and that's about it. This is a very specific kind of terrain work but you'll find that the same rules apply to any kind of custom terrain that you do. In regards to the rest of the project I'm going to be putting some buildings around here, some shops and maybe like a central tower, I don't know, um, being followed. But outside of the pit this is what I'm working on now. Uh, creative mode here in my tutorial studio thing whatever and this is the building that we're building next time wait what if you'd like to see a tutorial on this or something like this let me know because i'll do it in the following videos i'm going to be finishing off this island putting paths everywhere putting buildings everywhere putting villages everywhere so many people make trading halls so instead i'm just going to make a trading island there's going to be shops everywhere, there's going to be cool buildings everywhere, we're going to have a blacksmith, a fishmonger, is that what? A fish people, <laughs> blacksmiths, wizard tower, a butcher's, a farm, selling everything I might need. So whenever I need any trades, I can come to this island to get everything. That's the goal. Thank you very much for watching. Please do subscribe. Make sure to leave a like, subscribe, comment, join my Discord. Bye! -bye. Okay. More classics coming right up for you.